How's it going, everyone? It's your boy, Mr. Manning here, back again with another Gears of War 5 video. And today, guys, we're going to be looking at the brand new characters that were added to Gears of War 5 today. And the first thing that we actually been introduced here is the free execution, which is called the Curb Stomp Execution. You guys already know I'll be covering this in another video with all characters. I will try to do it with all cog and all swarm as well. But um it's great. Let's look at that execution. I honestly think that's for the snub. Yeah, it should be for the snub. Oh wait, hold on, there's a pummel. But you already what's the difference? Oh uh I think I'm, I'm gonna just I'll just pop that. Yeah, I'll just get it. But um, we have the curb stomp, which looks good. Uh, I prefer the old one, but you know this one does look cool. It does look cool as well. Um, I like their new take on it. The free curb stomp execution. Um, yeah, it looks good. It looks good, but. You guys are here for the brand new characters, am I right? Um, hold on. I was just here. What? Okay, here's the cog gear, which looks pretty sick. Can we look into it? Oh, wow. Um, hero, a trained soldier in the coalition of ordered governments is known as a gear. Which, um,. Of course, it has a little description of the character. There's a female and male version, which looks dope as hell, I must say. But of course, um, the challenges. Okay, we have here uh, craft the cog soldier totem, uh, complete 40 rounds of verses with the cog. Okay, uh, and then we, of course, we have survive 50 ways of horde. As the cog with the cog soldiers, and then we have um, earned 60,000 XP playing versus horde or escape with the cog gears, and then we have survived 18 chat. Wow, like they're making you grind for these stuff, bro. They're not like <laughs> making it easy for anyone to get these characters, which I like, which I like, I must say. Um, but you know. Your boy needs to get the characters, so I'ma just buy them. Uh, which they do look cool, honestly they do. So we got the male version. Let's look at his abilities. Wow, bro, he, he does look sick. I, I like the little updates that it did to the armor, which looks better, in my opinion, than the one that was introducing Gears of War 4. Uh, like the threading just looks so cool, man. It looks so realistic. And then, of course, there's the Horde. Oh, it comes with Lancer, Nasher. Okay, that's good. And then there's Arcade. What's the loadouts? Standard Lancer. It has a random weapon, a Retro Lancer, and a Claw. And then, of course, Bullets for Blood. Uh, receive Active Reload Ammo for Kills. That is freaking overpowered. And then Bonus X. Um, oh my goodness, bro. I hate the fact that I'm trying to do a video and haven't drink or eaten anything. <laughs> um, my bonus eliminations uh, earned a bonus elimination for multi kills, which is good. You spawn in with a flash grenade, a talon, and a lancer. This character looks cool altogether. But um, yep, it comes with two skins, which is the male version, like I said before, and the female version. If you guys want to see a all execution video for both of these characters you know please let me know in the comment section down below and I also saw on Twitter that um, operations 2 which is coming out in December um, the onyx guard is actually going to be a skin set for the cog gear it won't actually be its own like character per se but um, let's look at these um, expressions with this skin looks freaking dope and of course you got a stage bow. It looks amazing. 1v1. Of course, got the backpack. Looks cool. Hold back. 
and then okay we have the cheer looks amazing as well this looks cool with this character man this looks cool of course got the um, the mocking crane no no greetings love this animation with him it fits him so perfectly goodness got the slow clap gotta definitely put that on him sorry thumbs up this seems like a character that will actually do a thumbs up oh this is for the onyx guard shit I can't hear it yeah I have my mic <laughs> plugged into something else so I can't really hear it um, but I'm gonna just craft it and I'll just hear it later you guys in the video will probably hear it. I will hear it, of course, when I'm editing this video. But that Onyx Guard looks freaking sick, bro. Let me, let me. Hold on. Uh. Take off that. Put on that. But yeah, it the, the skin looks up completely amazing. I must say, even the female version, it looks amazing. absolutely stunning like the graphics and everything is completely better just look at oh my goodness man the armor <laughs> anyway going down to the DB which is finally on the cog side it was um, normally on the swarm side in Gears of War 4 um, we're just gonna take a good look at the urn of hero of course craft the DB <clears throat> complete 40 rounds of verses with the DB um, survive 50 waves of horde, um, earn 60, th like it, it's basically almost the same thing, kind of. And the last one was like DB's revenge, get 100 reject kills in horde and or escape. <laughs> oh my goodness. But, um, for the sake of the video, of course I'll be buying it. <laughs> DB actually looks cool, even though it looks like you know they didn't change much it still looks cool another character to play as and I couldn't be more happy of course they'll be adding different variants of the Shepherd DB um, let's look at these <laughs> this looks so cool man look at that backpack here <laughs> oh boy bro seeing a freaking DB do that that's that's actually funny I can see a DB actually doing that if Jack was a like if Jack was a DB this is what he would be doing if you saw Delta Squad doing some dumb shit Alright, so the DB doesn't have any like special um, emotes, but of course, I mean expressions, they'll be added later on to the game. I, I'm most certainly sure. <clears throat> okay, going on to Rom, of course. He's free, which is General Rom himself, which is a classic skin. This is the Gilded Rom, and then they added the normal Rom variant. Uh, it looks cool. I mean, I would rock it. Uh, but honestly, uh, I don't really play as Rom. If I do, I probably just want to play as different characters. <laughs> but um, mostly, like my favorite one by far has to be the um, the Warden. Like he's uh, ever since I saw him in uh, uh, the trailer. The oh my goodness, what what is that trailer called? Is the tech test trailer like he looks so freaking cool, bro? I saw him on that like when it launched, and I saw that trailer launched, and then like no one like spoke about it until like a few weeks ago. Everyone's like, "Oh my god!" You know, no, I think it was last week. <clears throat> Everyone was like, "Oh, the warden's coming," and I'm like, Are "You guys are just now finding this out, man." Anyway, moving on to the skin, it looks completely amazing. And then there, these are the challenges. You can pause the video, take a look at it, and um, they're really making you. If you don't want to pay for it, 
<laughs> this is the cost that you have to actually go through. <laughs> um, that's the warden. Of course, I'll be spending five hundred scrap, five dollars for this character. Shit, take my money, bro. Take my money. Of course, I'll be maining this character. I usually play as. Um, oh shit! Hold on. Oh, it spawns with a lancer, talent, smoke, and oh, it has um, Foz's uh, X-ray from Horde, which is pretty cool. Uh, yeah, I usually play as this character, the speaker. Uh, for some reason, he's like I don't know. He looks really, really, really sick in this game. Um, but yeah, I'll be like meaning the heck out of the warden. I'm sure they're gonna add different variants without the helmet and unarmored warden or I don't know. <laughs> but yeah, the warden by far is like one of my new favorite characters. Um, I know there's supposed to be a new DB or not a new DB, a new Terminator, Terminator character. But um, let me just oh. What are these? Oh. Never mind. Never mind. Uh, crafting and equipping a totem allows you to complete challenges and earn a new character. Oh, okay. So, like, the challenges. Yeah, so you just, like, equip these and then you play and it counts towards the, um, um, the objectives. Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's pretty cool. So I would craft this one. It says I don't have him, but I do. Whoa. That's weird. Is that a glitch or something? I'll be paying for a <laughs> character that I already have. I'm, if I'm not tripping, I'm sure I have the character. Yeah, yeah I do. For some reason, it was like allowing me to pay for the character. <laughs> but anyway, oh, I think it's because I never had the totem unlocked. I think that's the reason why. All right, that, yeah, that's about it. So I'm gonna just stick with the warden. Of course, I already bought the freaking character, but I, I don't know. It looks cool. The totems look cool. A brand new addition to gears, of course. Um, I'm just gonna like take these. Um, uh, I'm not gonna read these. I'm probably gonna save this from when I'm gonna play Horde. Uh, what else? What else? What else? There should be something new in this store. Did they show everything here? Uh, new characters, totems. Uh huh. Terminator the Dark Fate event. The onslaught of the machine begins with the Terminator Dark Fate Horde event. Running until October 29th. This special Horde event pits. <laughs> pits? That's a weird. Uh, I swear it was it. It would say puts cog heroes against waves, <laughs> pits, pits cog heroes against waves, or <laughs> of T eight hundreds. Oh, well, yeah, that's cool, bro. That's cool. I definitely would want to play that. October 29th. Oh, okay, we have like a good two weeks, a good week or so. Yeah. Okay, I know there's supposed to be some new cog characters. Why is this still? Okay, hold on. Let me see what new blood spray I got. I didn't get a new blood spray. Or did I pass it? I don't even see the blood spray. Oh, curb stomp. Let me open that one. And then curb stomp in this, I'm guessing. Alright, so I have that for three weapons already. I'll just stick with the knee base execution. And then, yeah. But let me just check the store to see if the skins are actually there. If you guys hear something in the background, I'm completely sorry. <laughs> uh, oh my goodness, bro. This game, of course. Go to a freaking Gears of War 5 page and they ask me which game do I want to see. Oh, Coalition, I love you so much. I know it's not your fault. 
Uh, Gears of War 5. Please pardon me. I'm trying to find this. Um, let me just pick this one to see what happens. Doesn't refresh. Okay. Uh, Gears Ultimate Edition. Yeah, there's some new Terminator packs that's supposed to be coming out. I think that's today. It should have been out already. Um, oh, okay. I'm just taking its sweet time loading. And there's nothing here to download. Oh. That's Game Pass. Do you have an. Oh, look at that. It's here. Brand new characters, guys. <laughs> And you guys already know I'm a. Oh, look at that. Uh, well, of course, I have my Xbox in pounds because I couldn't really buy anything in the US. For some reason, it region locked me for some reason. So I changed it to pounds. So 14 pounds and 85 pence with Xbox Game Pass for console. So I'm going to just buy. I'm going to just buy it because I don't have Game Pass on it. Oh. Yeah, this is going to be blurred out. But, uh, yeah, I'm pretty psyched, bro. I like, I'm glad it's coming out with new characters. People are pretty upset that, um, we have to buy these stuff. But, hey, they gave us the first one for free. Let me say that. And you could have played Xbox Game Pass, Ultimate Game Pass for one dollar a month so it was a complete grab in my opinion um, let's see if it has to download first it wasn't sent to my download so where's my oh no not that game gears 5 uh, do I need to manage nope nope okay I guess this is my what what am I doing? Do I have to restart the game to get the skins? But yeah, um, you know, let me know what you think inside the comment section on these new skins. What do you guys think? Are you um liking the fact that they're adding new characters and you have to grind for them or <laughs> um do you like the fact that we can pay and earn stuff like that? I mean I could have um, just sit down and try to earn them. Uh, but I don't know. If I can get it, and I know I can, I'll just get it. Honestly, if I want it right now. And of course, I have to do video content for these characters. I know everyone that's watching this would like to see an all executions with the warden, all executions with the brand new COG characters. And there's one or two of you that would that would want to see an all executions with the new Rev 9 I think that's what it's called correct me if I'm wrong inside the comic section of course I would have the have it somewhere in the title but um but yeah guys you know tell me what you guys think are you guys actually gonna take on the Terminator horde <laughs> that's happening this October 29th just let me know I definitely definitely want to hear your feedback on this um, I'm all for it, man. I, I I love this damn game. I know there's some people complaining about the microtransactions, but honestly, I'm working 24/7, and when I come home, I don't really have that much time to grind. And like when I do record a video, it actually takes up my whole entire time, honestly, and, and I barely have any time to actually play. Uh, so anyway. Let's see if I unlock these characters, if I did or did not. Uh, I'm going to just go to wa watch. Yep. It didn't make me buy the characters. Oh, boy. Wait. Oh, it loaded in. Ha. Got him. The game got me, bro. The Rev 9. Yeah, I was correct. This character looks even slimmer than the freaking T-800. If you thought the T-800 was war was bad friggin bro look at this bro <laughs> Jeez. oh my goodness it's like alright well you think this skin you can't see 
and it's too small to hit. Let's just up the difficulty. Bro. <laughs> what is this, bro? Alright, I'll just equip it. It looks pretty sick, honestly. There's new banners. Of course, with the Terminator. Uh, I'm probably going to be blind and like go right past it. I don't see it. I'm I'm blind. Yep. Oh, see it here. That looks cool. Of course I won't rock it because I don't know. <laughs> and let's go to Sarah. Oh, it's a character by itself. Grace. Huh. Okay. This character looks dope as hell. I in the promo pictures, I thought those like lines on her arms were like veins or something like that. I was like, damn, bro. That's my muscular woman. But yeah, bro, she looks clean. Of course, I actually do like this character. But yeah, I will definitely do a all executions with these characters. I'm definitely going to be playing as her for a bit. And then I'll probably make my way to the DB. Uh, definitely take out, um, definitely play as a car gear from time to time. But, um, yeah, guys, just let me know what you guys think inside the comment section with these new characters and skins coming out for the game. Of course, everything will just get better after time and after time. Oh, wait, hold on. Just before we go, what's in here? Oh, there's the roundhouse execution. What the frick? Bitch, I'm definitely buying that shit. <laughs> Jeez, bro, that frightened the shit out of me. <laughs> it looks so freaking clean. Roundhouse kick. Roundhouse. <laughs> I can just hear Peter in my freaking head. Roundhouse. Mm -hmm. I like it. Definitely have to call up this, bro. It looks pretty sick. I'm trying to get all the collections here. Alright. Uh, I'm going to equip that. Okay, okay, we have the Heroes tab, which look even a better way to like introduce these damn characters. Jeez Louise, man, it looks so freaking cool. Of course, you got the villain, Warden, Rom, damn. And we have the eSports special offer. I could have just came here and bought the damn skin. I went to the damn store and got it. <laughs> anyway. Uh, what else? Did they add new flags? Bro, when are they gonna add the friggin' Cayman Islands frag, bro? I said frag instead of flag. The Cayman Islands flag needs to be added. Honestly. New boost, and then there's iron. Yeah. Why does it say have something new? Oh. Uh, yeah, it's just this. But yeah, um, you know, let me just let me know what you guys think inside the comment section. It truly means a lot that you guys actually like stay around and enjoy the content, leaving a like, and you know, it, and the interaction with you guys is completely amazing. Oh, that one looks cool. It looks like Anthony Carmine in a way. Of course, it's the helmet is really resembling him but um anyway guys i hope you guys enjoy the video it truly means a lot that you guys stop by if you haven't done so already make sure to hit that like button and subscribe for everything gears of war 5 related until next time guys peace